It is recommended that when teaching a position in the quick editor or at any time on the robot, it is always better to physically move the robot with the sliders to the position required. If the position is known and you want to numerically input the position, this is possible. Select the parameter by clicking on the appropriate parameter required. Select the specific axes. And here in the value box, you can numerically input it by selecting the value. And here it will show you a minimum and a maximum value that can be set based on the axis stroke. If you know the position, you can then input it numerically by inputting the value into the keypad and select enter. The value is the position that the robot will drive to in the program when in automatic, dry cycle, or step mode. The current position shows currently where the robot is. Since we have changed the position in the program numerically, we can now, if required, move to that taut position by using the go to slider. The robot will move only to the taut position and then stop when it is achieved. Once again, it is recommended that you always teach a position by driving the robot to the position to verify it. Only use a numerical position input when you are 100% sure that that position is correct.